happened to see the aquarium laying on the side of the road and wasn't sure what it was, so I backed up to see it and it was eight foot bow. And I took my foot and slid him back in the aquarium and put him in my trunk and come to work with it. I got back to work here and my boss come out to see it and he called, I think, the sheriff and then they got a hold of the BGSU reptile department and they come out and got it about an hour later. I am an associate professor of biological sciences at BGSU and the director of the BGSU Herpetarium. Showed up at the ODOT facility and I thought the guys were great. They had picked the cage up, put a piece of plywood over the top because there was no lid on it um, and had a shop light at the other end trying to warm the snake. So they, they did everything perfectly. It got down to 31 degrees that night. I'm surprised she survived. I, I'll be honest, the second day I came in, I was expecting to find a dead snake. She's perfectly healthy. She has gone through one shed. The snake the students have named ODOT. It is a boa constrictor constrictor, simply a common boa. We do not know if it's male or female. She's probably between six and seven feet long. And she's just, she's gonna be a sweet, I think she'd probably make a good presentation animal. Because she does seem, she's active and friendly. Please, if you have an animal that you can't maintain, contact the Humane Society. They will take it and find it a home.